What's up guys, the first NA regional of the Spring Split had a whole new winner and lots of other surprises. With the Spring Cup this weekend, the room for error is getting slimmer and slimmer if you want to make the major. In this video, I will once again try to predict the outcome of the event to see who stands tall and who crumbles under the pressure. Alright guys, since I feel like the first rounds sometimes drag on a little bit, I will fill all of them out and just tell you what I thought about the matches. So this right here was my round number one. You can see a lot of the higher seeds winning their matches, but I also tossed in some upsets because it's NA after all and everything can happen. And while I think Shopify versus V1 could go either way, I gave this one to version 1 because when they announced the roster move, my prediction was that they would have a slow start and then pick up the pace towards the end of the split and the slow start so far was true. So now they need some upwards trajectory and in the last regional, if I remember that correctly, they also won this match. It's a rematch. Yes, they won 3-0. and oh. So this run right here, definitely possible. Then G2 going through. And then the first big upset I had in here was Optic losing their first round match. Don't worry guys they're not gonna be out right away but i feel like everyone knows now how good they are and that they are finally getting their results in regionals as well not only in scrims and that's why everyone is trying even harder to beat them now and i think m80 can't be happy with the last regional and they have to bounce back now otherwise it would be a very disappointing split for them and then face clan and genji have to win their games and for dignitas versus furia dignitas also very disappointing first regional furia always a bit back and forth i could imagine them to have a deep run but for whatever reason, they simply never can get it done. And that's why I think this result is also possible. And then for SSG versus Energy. SSG, very good first regional. And Energy had to go to round five in the close qualifiers. My hopes for them are entirely gone now with this one. And that's why I don't think they stand any chance against SSG. And we're going to move on to the upper round here. They actually have all the favorites winning their matches. Complexity as the latest regional winners have to win this. D2 then, last regional, they went to the lower bracket quite early. You can see it right here. They lost their first match against Sub right away and then had to make an insane lower bracket run i think they're gonna be at the upper bracket for a little longer this time and therefore win this match if it was optic going through here against m80 i think optic would win against g2 though but since i had this upset in here i think g2 can beat m80 and therefore i think this makes sense face winning their match as well and then gen g was space station in three and one also definitely possible in my opinion i feel like gen g still has the edge over ssg they are just the better team at the moment and now we're gonna get into the spicy part where it is about who goes out on day one and for this one i don't have too many surprises i don't think axel is gonna go too far and shopify i said it's in every prediction i think they are kind of underrated but they never get the result that shows what this roster is really capable of just like with furia and that's why they never go too far but i still think they are better than most of the close qualifier teams so they're gonna take this one and optic bouncing back against koi koi with another disappointing result in this prediction in my last prediction i had them in like top six or even top four and i was extremely disappointed in them so so this time I'm gonna rate them very low. Maybe they're gonna have a deep run now. Would actually be funny if I reverse curse them. But we're gonna see how it turns out. Optic probably just a better team. Then 0 to 1 going out against Furia and Energy getting a dub on the board. But as I said, I don't think they're gonna go too far. Which is why in the next round I have them going out against version 1. As I said, V1 has to go a little bit further than last time. And that's why I think they're gonna win this one right here. Then Furia tossing out M80. I'm not entirely sure about M80 in this split. Last split they looked very good. One games against like FaZe and had a top eight or even a top four and this split it's not looking quite as good for them so i think they could lose this right here then optic continuing their lower bracket run just like ssg against shopify and that concludes the day number one of this spring open and now we're going to move over to the upper semi-finals and i guys have complexity being very convincing in this one right here they just seem to be the hottest team at the moment so i don't think they will have any problems beating g2 right here and then in the other upper semi-final i might have a surprise here i think if i would have predicted this before the last regional everyone would have probably just said yeah this makes the most sense but given the last regional and faces result in there this might be a bit of a surprise but i think face can't be too happy with the last regional and therefore they're going to bounce back this time they're going to turn things around they want to lock in the world spot right here right now and that's why they're going to beat genji here and then we're going to move over to the lower side of the bracket and there we have some exciting matches as well i have optic continuing their run against ssg ssg was under the radar for the first regional. everyone was like like Daniel is gone now this has to be a downgrade and it actually wasn't but since the teams know now how good they are they're gonna have a harder time I believe and Optic is gonna take them down and then V1 as I said they need to win this for my prediction to come through of them improving throughout the spring split and Furia I said it multiple times already kind of inconsistent and for the next round I have Optic repeating their success from the last region because if we look over here they played in the exact same round it was a 4-2 and, and I think it's gonna repeat just like that they're gonna take them down 4-2 and, and then Genji is gonna face V1 
move on. And I think Genji is just going to be the better team right here. It's going to be a clean 4-0. We were not quite ready yet to tackle these big teams. But the top six in the second regional is going to be very good for them. And there's going to be more in store for them in the Invitational. And that brings us to Championship Sunday. And in here, I have another little surprise coming because I feel like FaZe could win this. I said it, FaZe wants to lock in that world spot right here, right now. So they're going to take out the complexity, toss them to the lower bracket. In the lower bracket, though, Gen G is going to take down Optic. All of these games could go either way. I feel like out of these four, everyone could beat each other at any given time if they have a better day individually. So I think this is definitely possible. Over here, we have Complexity versus Gen G now. And Complexity seem to have the edge over Gen G a couple of times now, especially in the last regional, beating them twice. So I think they're going to repeat it just like that. And then we're going to have Pace versus Complexity in the grand final. Complexity trying to go back to back, but it's not going to be enough because the upper bracket team basically wins almost every time. I think FaZe is going to bounce back big time here and get this regional win. And now we're going to get the full bracket on the screen here. And this right here is how I think the Spring Cup will go down. As always, would love to hear from you guys what you think about my predictions and what your predictions are. Always fun to read through the comments. And if you enjoyed this video, leave a sub with me in the world to me and I'll see you guys next time.